Bill Kaninsky of Stevens Point, Wisconsin is this year's recipient of the Outstanding Biology Teacher Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. The award is given in recognition of outstanding biology teaching by an alumnus of the biology department. There is a network of teachers all around the state that have come through the UWSP biology program. Annually, one of these teachers is not only recognized for excellence in the classroom, but for being a professional role model for the student's own career path. These teachers also serve as unofficial recruiters for the UWSP biology program. Bill retired from a career spanning 33 years teaching sophomore biology, advanced biology, ecology, and astronomy at Stevens Point Area Senior High. After retirement in 2011, he became an associate lecturer at UWSP teaching courses in several disciplines such as biology, introductory natural resources, and study skills. Bill received his bachelor's degree from UWSP in biology in 1975. He earned a Master's of Arts from in Teaching from UWSP in 1983. In addition to teaching at SPASH, Bill coached swimming for 10 years, mentored numerous student teachers, and led many field trips, including a much beloved spring trip to the International Crane Foundation in Baraboo, Wisconsin, and to Devils Lake State Park. Congratulations, Bill. Wisconsin is this year's recipient of the Outstanding Professional Contribution Award from the UWSP Biology Department. This award recognizes the outstanding contributions of an individual that is not a paid member of the faculty or staff in the biology department. Past recipients have included veterinarians that work with our captive animals, physicians that expand our courses with their real world experiences and provide valuable shadowing opportunities for our students, ecologists that have taken our students to new levels of environmental awareness, and local business persons that provide supplies and services to support the work of our department. Keith became building manager in 2018 of UWSP's newest addition, the Chemistry and Biology Building. The biology department is granting him this award because of the extraordinary effort he put forth helping both the chemistry and biology departments move into the new building. Keith has been a master in dealing with the various unforeseen challenges with the new building itself and in the move of dozens of laboratories worth of equipment and materials into the new space. Prior to becoming building manager, Keith managed the Molecular Genetics Lab at UWSP Fisheries Cooperative Research Unit, where he oversaw DNA sequencing activities for dozens of research projects. He has co-authored numerous manuscripts for publication in research journals, and he holds a bachelor's degree in urban forestry from in 2004 and a master's degree in forestry um, in 2011 from UWSP. Congratulations, Keith. Lawton Rhinus a senior biology major from La Crosse, Wisconsin, is this year's recipient of the Aldo Leopold Audubon Society Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point. This award recognizes a student who shows ambition to work on environmental preservation through research and or political action. The Aldo Leopold Audubon Society is our local Stevens Point chapter of the larger national organization. Its mission is to conserve and restore natural ecosystems for the benefit of humanity and for biodiversity. Rhinus plans to pursue a career in the field of conservation biology. He hopes to someday work with the Mississippi Valley Conservancy to restore native habitats and ecosystem functioning throughout the driftless region of Wisconsin and Minnesota. At UWSP, he is a teaching assistant for vascular plant taxonomy and is working with soils professor Dr. Jake Prater to create web-based soil management tools. He is an active member of the UWSP Adventure Club and Students for Sustainability. Congratulations, Lawton. Nathan Wendland, a senior biology major from Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin, is this year's recipient of the Ray and Jean Shippey Memorial Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. This scholarship was established by former biology department staff member Jane Shippey and her husband Bobby Gifford to provide financial assistance to a deserving biology major. The scholarship honors the memory of Jane's parents, Ray and Jean Shippey, Ray Shippey and his twin brother owned and operated Shippey's Men and Boys Clothing Store in downtown Stevens Point for several decades. Ray always gave generously in the community, and he and Jean supported their daughter through her time at UW Stevens Point. Upon graduation from UWSP, Wendland plans to go to graduate school to study herpetology with the ultimate goal of obtaining a PhD and becoming a professor. At UWSP, he is a teaching and lab assistant for Dr. Pete Zaney and serves as the assistant curator of the herpetology collection. 
Wenland also volunteers with the UWSP Herpetological Society as an animal caretaker in the vivarium and tutors chemistry and biology at the Teaching and Learning Center. Congratulations, Nathan. Congratulations to Leah Gastonguay. Leah is a junior biology major from Stevens Point, Wisconsin, and she is this year's recipient of the Portage County Master Gardeners Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. Funded by the Portage County Master Gardeners Chapter, this award goes to a student with interests in plant biology, and Leah certainly has those, specifically gardening, horticulture, or plant conservation. The recipients are expected to give a presentation to the organization during their year of scholarship. After graduation, Gaston Gway plans to pursue graduate studies in plant pathology or environmental sustainability issues. And here at UWSP, she's been a teaching assistant for several introductory courses. She's been and still is a greenhouse technician, a lab manager in the UWSP Social and Environmental Psychology Lab, and she conducts research with me, Dr. Brian Berenger, using scanning electron microscopy to characterize pollination systems in the genus Clarkia, and also with Dr. Chung Soon, studying Pierce's disease in grape varieties. And finally, she is an active, very active member, actually, in the Botany Club, and in fact, she's just been elected to be the club's new secretary. So congratulations, Leah, very much well-deserved. It's my pleasure to introduce to you Alan Hamilton. Alan is a junior biology major from Wausau, Wisconsin, and she's this year's recipient of the North Central Wisconsin Master Gardener Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Department of Biology. Funded by the North Central Wisconsin Master Gardeners, this award goes to a student with interest in plant biology, specifically gardening horticulture or plant conservation. The North Central Wisconsin Master Gardeners cover Marathon County, Wisconsin, and has over 70 active volunteer members. Ellen has a self-professed and lifelong passion for plant biology. After graduation, she hopes to work in horticulture or plant pathology. I first met Ellen at UWSP when she was a student in my Biology 130 class, where all the good ones start. While she's been at UWSP, she's conducted research with me on the algal communities of Lake George in upstate New York. And on campus, she's an active member of the volunteer staff at WWSP 90FM, your only alternative, the award-winning campus radio station. You should put on a tie-dye t-shirt and check out her Grateful Dead show called Dead Ahead. Ellen's also been on the track team and plays intramural soccer. Once again, Congratulations, Ellen. Great job. Lauren Volkman, a senior biochemistry and natural science major from Stevens Point, Wisconsin, is one of this year's recipients of a biology faculty research award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. These prestigious awards go to biology or biochemistry majors who have distinguished themselves with innovative, determined research activities. These awards are funded through contributions made by biology department faculty. Volkman is currently involved in research in my lab. She's been busy working on chemically isolating as well as testing antibacterial compounds and possibly anti-cancer compounds from a fungus isolated from an obscure plant called a liverwort. She recently participated in a National Science Foundation REU internship at Northeastern University in Boston, studying the structure and function of a protein called HRAS. She is also an active member of the UWSP Biochemistry Club. Upon graduation, Volkman plans to pursue graduate work in microbiology, she ultimately hopes to become a professor in order to unite two of her main passions, scientific research and education. It's been a real pleasure to work with her. She's really impressed me with her ability to devote herself to research 
while maintaining a heavy course load and high academic standards. I'm very excited to be able to continue working with her. Congratulations, Lauren, a well-deserved award. Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Diane Caporell, and it's my honor to announce that Braden Steger, a senior biochemistry major from Hortonville, Wisconsin, is one of this year's recipients of the Biology Faculty Research Award from the University of Wisconsin-Stevens Point Biology Department. These awards go to biology or biochemistry majors who have distinguished themselves with innovative, determined research activities. These awards are funded through contributions from the biology department faculty. Upon graduation, Braden plans to work in the biomedical field to further and eventually earn a medical degree, which I have no doubt he'll be successful at. At UWSP, um, he conducted research with me in my laboratory for about a year and a half, including the summer, and where he assumed the role as lead researcher guiding over four students who studied the genetic components of disorders such as hereditary spherocytosis, um, muscular dystrophy, and probionic acidemia. Since 2017, Braden has shadowed numerous healthcare professionals, including a chiropractor in Appleton, um, physicians at Previa Health in Green Bay, and radiologists in the Fox Valley area. He's one of the quarterbacks, actually, um, on UWSP football team, hence the uh, um, the uniform, and uh, he's participated in numerous charitable events in Severance Point community. And if you, uh, any of you know Braden, you'd know that he's quite gregarious, um, the fastest speaker that I've ever come across. Um, he didn't really slow down in those years and a half, but needless to say, he will be certainly a wonderful physician someday, I have no doubt. And let's give him a congratulations. Congratulations, and you will be sorely missed. It's my honor to present the Biology Faculty Research Award to Mallory Zelli from Toma, Wisconsin. I met Mallory at last year's award banquet when she was an outstanding sophomore and uh, we started talking about teeth. So this fall she helped me with a research project on flying squirrels, measuring tooth rows and um, Helping out with a, a, a team that's hopefully going to be publishing this work as part of a way to distinguish between northern and southern flying squirrels. She taught herself how to use a programmable digital cal caliper and just did all the work. It was amazing. She's a fantastic student. It's an honor to have her in our program. Congratulations, Mallory. Congratulations to Lily Taylor. Lily is a senior biology major from Litchfield, Illinois, and she is one of this year's recipients of a biology faculty research award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. These awards go to biology or biochemistry majors who have distinguished themselves with innovative, determined research activities, and Lily has certainly done that. These awards are funded through contributions from the biology department faculty. Upon graduation, Lily plans to pursue graduate studies on invasive exotic species in either aquatic or terrestrial environments. She has worked with Dr. Dan Graff, georeferencing freshwater mussel records for the Wind Vertebrates website. And she is currently working on a hemp horticulture project with me, Dr. Brian Berenger. In fact, she's been very instrumental in helping me get that project off the ground and has worked very hard on that. Lily belongs to the Gamma Phi Delta Sorority, the UWSP French Club, and the International Club. So congratulations, Lily, very much deserved. It's my pleasure to introduce to you, Julia Zapluski. Julia is a senior biology major from Greenfield, Wisconsin, and she's this year's recipient of the Outstanding Botanist Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Department of Biology. The Outstanding Botanist recognizes students that have conducted original and meritorious research in plant biology, and it's funded by the donations from the plant biology faculty and staff and the proceeds from the sale of the Biology 130 lab manual. Julie is currently conducting research on soil color and organic matter content with Dr. Scharnbrauch. 
Julia has substantial horticultural experience from working with the Farm Shed Program and the Burner Botanic Gardens, and she's also an active member of the UWSB Ethnobotanical Botanical Club. I first got to know Julia when she was a student in my Biology 130 class as a freshman years ago. Last year, she came back to me in Phycology, and we had a great time learning about algae. And then this semester, my final semester at UWSP, she joined me and 15 others in a special topics class where we read two great books, The Story of Earth and The Secret Knowledge of Water. And I really enjoyed hearing her feedback and contributions in that class. Upon graduation, Julia plans to attend graduate school. She is particularly interested in plant ecology and evolution with an emphasis on wetland species conservation. Once again, congratulations, Julia. Well deserved. Friends, a junior biology and philosophy double major from Sheboygan, Wisconsin, is this year's recipient of the Royal Anderson Ecology Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. UWSP biology graduate Royal V. Anderson established this award in 1987 in memory of his wife, Fran Anderson, a tireless civic voice for environmental protection and the first woman of the year named by Milwaukee Sentinel. This award goes to a student with interest in ecology as demonstrated by coursework, research activity, and career goals. Upon graduation, Krentz plans to pursue graduate research in marine ecology. He is particularly interested in the ecology of marine mammals and coral reefs. His long-range goal is to study the ecology of the Great Barrier Reef of Australia. Krentz is currently conducting research with Dr. Slemons and Sipiorski on historical diatom communities in the Plover and Tomorrow Rivers in central Wisconsin. He is a member of his residence hall governance and the UWSP Fly Fishing and Botany Clubs. Congratulations, Kevin. Cora Thompson, a biology and Spanish double major from Sheboygan, Wisconsin, is this year's recipient of the Brian Egan Memorial Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. Brian Richard Egan was a UWSP biology student at the time of his unfortunate death. His father, Dr. Bud Egan, was a longtime UWSP administrator, and the family has funded two student awards every year since 1970 in memoriam to Brian. The Brian Egan Research Award goes to an outstanding biology major with a high GPA. In most years, Bud personally handed out the Brian Egan Award, but sadly he passed away this past April at the age of 100. Upon graduation, Thompson intends to pursue graduate studies in mammalian reproductive physiology. She conducts research with Dr. Bodensteiner, which is me, on reproductive biology by comparing reproductive parameters in transgenic and non-transgenic mice with ovarian histology. On campus, she is a tutor in the tutoring and math science program and for the Tutoring Learning Center. She is fluent in Spanish and plays in the UWSP pep band. Cora is an all-around amazing person. She's extremely hardworking. She's a fantastic student researcher, and I have been very fortunate to work with her for the last few years. Trent Ress, a junior biology major from Abbotsford, Wisconsin, is this year's recipient of the Brian Egan Research Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. Brian Richard Egan was a UWSP biology student at the time of his unfortunate death. His father, Dr. Burdett Bud Egan, was a longtime UWSP administrator, and the family has funded two student awards every year since 1970, in memoriam to Brian. The Brian Egan Research Award goes to an outstanding biology major with a significant involvement in research. In most years, but personally handed out the Brian Egan Award. Sadly, he passed away this past April at age 100. Upon graduation, Raz plans to pursue a career in uh, forensic botany. He hopes to use his knowledge of plant anatomy, plant taxonomy, plant physiology, ecology, genetics, and scan electron microscopy to aid in the solving of criminal cases. He conducts research in DNA barcoding plants with a Dr. Stephanie Liang and bryophytes taxonomy with a Dr. Virginia 
Frady. Uh, he is a student assistant in the UWSP herbarium and also works with me on grapevine PS disease. Trent, congratulations on receiving this award. Josh Kivett, a junior biology and restoration ecology double major from Burnsville, Minnesota, is this year's recipient of the Gordon E. Giesman Junior Botanist Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. Established in 1992 by Dr. Gordon E. Giesman after a long career in the Department of Biology, this award recognizes an outstanding biology major with junior standing and evidence of interest in plant biology. Upon graduation, Kivett hopes to enter the Peace Corps to assist with sustainable land management in a Spanish-speaking nation. He eventually hopes to pursue a graduate degree and to work in the field of ecological restoration. While at UWSP, he has been involved in several research projects, uh, surveying advanced, uh, invasive plant species in the understory of Steinhagen Recreation Area with Dr. James Cook, and assessing the presence of fishers in the Mead Wildlife Area Mead Wildlife Area with Dr. Katie Sartini. In 2019, he worked for the Colorado State University as a lupin surveyor on the grounds of Fort McCoy to identify Carner Blue Butterfly Habitat Corridors. This summer, he will be working for the Madison Audubon Society as a restoration ecology intern at the Fayville Grove Sanctuary. He's also an excellent field botanist. Congratulations, Josh. Congratulations to Hannah Malakovich. Hannah is a junior biology major from Economawak, Wisconsin, and she is this year's recipient of the Southeast Wisconsin Master Gardeners Incorporated Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. The Southeast Wisconsin Master Gardeners Incorporated is a nonprofit corporation committed to educating the public in evidence based horticultural practices. Recipients of this award should have a passion for horticulture or plant biology and a willingness to share their knowledge through community service. And Hannah certainly has all of those things in spades. Upon graduation, Hannah plans to find work in horticulture or plant sciences and ultimately to pursue graduate studies in plant biology. She currently conducts research with me, Dr. Brian Berenger, using scanning electron microscopy to characterize pollination systems in the genus Clarkia. She is also working with graphic art students to design and construct interpretive signs for the UWSP Tropi Tropical Conservatory. And in summer 2019, she worked with UWSP alum Chris Tyrell preparing histological slides for bamboo research and cataloging plant photos at the Milwaukee Public Museum. She is also an active member, a very active member of the UWSP Botany Club. And as a matter of fact, she has just been elected as the new president of that club. So congratulations, Hannah, very much deserved. I am proud to present the Kent D. Hall Animal Physiology Scholarship to Michelle Miller, a senior biology major from Menasha, Wisconsin. Upon his retirement in 1998, Dr. Kent Hall established this scholarship as an expression of admiration and respect for the more than 5,000 students he taught during his distinguished 30-year teaching career at UWSP as an animal physiologist. This honor goes to the student determined by the department to be the most academically outstanding student of the year in our animal physiology course. Michelle Miller is an outstanding student, both in animal physiology and in all of her courses. Upon graduation, she plans to enroll in veterinary school She's worked as an intern in bovine studies, focusing on calf health and as a veterinary treatment. And she's interned with the Wisconsin DNR, studying the lymph nodes of white-tailed deer that are suspected to be infected with chronic wasting disease. On campus, she is an active member of the Wildlife Society. Congratulations, Michelle. Ruth Phillips, a junior biochemistry major from Abula, Kuwait, is this year's recipient of the Saul Sepsonwall Human Physiology Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. Established by Dr. Saul Sepsonwall after his retirement from the UWSP Biology Department in 2017, this award goes to the highest performing student in human physiology for the academic year. Dr. Sepsonwall taught human physiology, endocrinology, and immunology at UWSP for over 30 years. Upon graduation, Phillips plans to enroll in medical school to ultimately specialize in oncology. Last summer, she volunteered with the Kuwait Association for Care of Children in Hospitals 
an agency established in Kuwait working with hospitals to provide better care and treatment to the child admins. Through this program, she worked beside a child life specialist. She engaged with physicians with numerous specialties. Phillips spent most of her time organizing arts and crafts activities for the admitted children. She also provided bedside care and companionship. The main objective here is to reduce stress in children undergoing treatment for medical conditions. Congratulations, Ruth. I'm pleased to present the Eric Munson Memorial Award to Brittany Dole, a senior biology major from Janesville, Wisconsin. This scholarship was created in memory of Eric S. Munson, who passed away in 1992 while working towards his doctorate degree. His high scholastic achievement, dedication, and interest in avian biology was the inspiration for an undergrad scholarship in his honor. Eric was passionately dedicated to the investigation of the ecology of birds, both in the classroom and in the field. Eric participated in several student-sponsored ornithological activities and frequently interacted with UWSP faculty regarding their avian research. He often assisted undergraduate students with their bird-related interests. Upon graduation, Brittany plans to seek employment at a zoological park or a wildlife rehabilitation facility. She's particularly interested in using ambassador animals to engage the public on wildlife conservation issues. At UWSP, she has conducted research in my lab, studying the neurobiology and behavior of zebra finches. She's one of the most creative research students I've ever had. She's also an active member of the Wildlife Society. Congratulations, Brittany. I would like to give a huge congratulations to Zach Ziegler, a junior biology major from Appleton, Wisconsin, who is this year's recipient of the Edgar Pearson Award. This scholarship was created by Grace Pearson and her son, John, to honor the memory of Professor Edgar Pearson. Dr. Pearson was a UWSP biology professor for an amazing 42 years. He was also the first dean of the UWSP graduate school. This award recognizes the biology major with junior standing that has the highest GPA in the major. Upon graduation, Zach hopes to attend Physician Assistant School. Over the 2020 winter procession, he participated in the UWSP Winter Perceptorship Program at the Marshfield Clinic. During this time, he was able to shadow medical professionals in multiple specialties, such as cardiology, pulmonary medicine, nuclear medicine, orthopedics, oncology, family practice, and neurology. He is also very active on campus. Zach is a member of the Tri Beta Biological Honor Society, in which he serves as vice president, and he is also a member of the Phi Eta Sigma Honor Society and the Pre-Medicine Pre-PA Club. He also volunteers at the St. Michael's Hospital Emergency Department, the Marshfield Clinic Community Connections Team, the UWSP Office of Sustainability, and also at the Harbor House Shelter. When he is not busy studying or volunteering, he also works as a CNA. It is clear, based on this award, that Zach is an incredibly dedicated and talented student. After getting to know him well over the past year, he has blown me away with his maturity, intellectual curiosity, and passion for helping others. I have no doubt in my mind that he will make an outstanding physician assistant. Congratulations, Zach. It's my pleasure to introduce to you Brianna. Havens. Bree is a senior biology and psychology double major from Lake Geneva, Wisconsin, and she's this year's recipient of the Robert Wilde Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Department of Biology. Bob Wilde was a longtime UWSP biology faculty member, and he established this award in 1992 to recognize a biology major with high GPA, quality research productivity, and strong evidence of leadership qualities. These are all traits that Bree shows over and over and over again in all the things that she does. Upon graduation, Bree intends to apply for an internship at the Pacific Primate Sanctuary, and she plans to conduct graduate studies in the neuroendocrinology of behavior and hopes to study bonobos in their natural habitat. She's also a winner of a prestigious national, nationally competitive Goldwater Scholarship. Bree's worked with numerous UWSP faculty on several research projects, including Dr. Alger's zebra finch breeding projects, 
Dr. Melinda Figueroa's Rodent Breeding and Behavior Projects, and Dr. Ferguson's Social Environmental Psychology Lab. She has an internship with Primates Incorporated as one of the live-in stewards of their captive macaque troop. And on campus, she's an active member and organizer for promoting awareness, victim empowerment, or PAVE. Once again, congratulations, Bree. Well-deserved, great job. Keegan Brighton, a senior biochemistry major from Plainview, Minnesota, is this year's recipient of the Blanche Ponchek Biology Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin-Stevens Point Biology Department. This award was named by Gilbert J. Ketchmerick in honor of his grandmother, Blanche Ponchek, who supported and inspired Mr. Ketchmerick in his professional ambitions. Gilbert Ketchmerick graduated from UWSP in 1960 with a major in chemistry and an interest in biology. He enjoyed conducting research on campus with encouragement from Dr. Roland Triton and other faculty members. He went on to have a successful career spanning 37 years as a chemist with the City of Milwaukee Purification Department. And now a little bit about Keegan Brighton. Keegan had a pre-medical focus during his time at UWSP Originally planning to attend medical school, his post-graduation plans now are to pursue graduate programs in biomedical or genetic research. This summer, he'll be starting an online master's degree program in biotechnology. While at UWSP, Keegan had conducted microbiological research in my lab. His research project involved investigating levels and types of microorganisms in bathroom air. Keegan also did research with Dr. Snyder and Dr. Lawrence in the chemistry department. This past fall, he received first place in the oral undergraduate research presentations at the American Society for Microbiology North Central Branch meeting. Keegan also is an awardee of a UWSP Oscar grant. Keegan was a very active student in the tutoring program. He tutored in biology, chemistry, physics, and mathematics. He even continued tutoring during the COVID-19 shutdown. Keegan was also president of the UWSP Men's Rugby Club and an active team member throughout his entire time at UWSP. Keegan was a very fun student to have in the lab and I will miss working with him. Sorry, we never had a chance to pursue that raccoon project that you wanted to work on. But I do want to congratulate you and wish you the very best in your future. It's my pleasure to introduce Michael Dombrowski, the winner of the Pucci Student Scholarship. First, a little bit about the award. This award is uh, by Mike Pucci who is a UWSP biology graduate in honor of his grandfather and father. Um, Ralph Pucci had a long career as a teacher and a coach, who is Mike's father. The student that is nominated, Michael Dombrowski, was a student of mine in human anatomy, who actually was excited to come to class at 9 a.m. Um, he did quite well. He is... Um, he is very interested in pre-med studies. He's participated in the UWSP pre-med preceptorship. He is part of the pre-med club, the biochemistry club. He's a certified nursing assistant. He's shadowed a number of PAs and MPs. And I really just want to go ahead and congratulate Michael on his hard work. Dr. Sarah Orlovsky of Rudolph, Wisconsin, is this year's recipient of the Pucci Faculty Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. A suite of awards were established in 1994 by Mike Pucci, a UWSP biology graduate, in honor of his grandfather and father. The Pucci Faculty Award is given in honor of PJ Pucci, Mike's grandfather, from Davenport, Iowa, whose family immigrated to the United States in 1907. Mr. Pucci dropped out of school at the age of 12 to support his family after the death of his father in a construction accident. He subsequently financed his son Ralph's college education as well as his grandson Mike's education. The Pucci Faculty Award is granted by a vote from the faculty. There are four nominees 
and then UWSP biology majors vote on the final winner. A native of southeastern Wisconsin, Dr. Orlovsky received her undergraduate degree in biology from UWSP in 2006 and her PhD from the University of Colorado Boulder in 2013. After spending four years as a faculty member at Northeastern Illinois University, she joined the UWSP biology department in 2017. She teaches animal parasitology, ecological methods, principles of evolution, introductory animal biology, and senior seminar. This year, the department also honored Dr. Orlovsky with the Excellence in Scholarship Award. Congratulations, Sarah. Monica Schauer, a senior biology major from Mayville, Wisconsin, was this year's recipient of the Robert W. Freckman Herbarium Service Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. This award, funded by Herbarium Associated Faculty, honors the life work of plant taxonomist UWSP Professor Emeritus Robert W. Freckman and goes to a person who has made significant meritorious contributions to the herbarium. After graduation, Schauer is headed to the University of Wisconsin-Madison to pursue a master's degree in agroecology. She is particularly interested in using crop plants for pollution mitigation and carbon sequestration and developing sustainable ways to maintain soil health. Schauer is a member of Dr. Berenger's research group studying the ecology of the genus Clarkia. Last summer, she worked for the Wisconsin Conservation Corps and AmeriCorps at the Indiana Dunes National Park to rehabilitate wetland habitats. She was a founding member of the UWSP Botany Club and served as president for three years. She was also an active member of the Biochemistry Club and her residence hall leadership. Schauer is receiving the Freckman Award in recognition of her work as the Herbarium's student collection manager and a teaching assistant uh, for vascular plant taxonomy over the past two years, as well as for her broader efforts to increase visibility of the herbarium and the botanical sciences at UWSP. Congratulations, Monica. I would like to give a huge congratulations to Sydney Ricchetto, a junior biochemistry major from Wausau, Wisconsin, who is this year's recipient of the Harris Ogundipi Scholarship. A 1982 biology department graduate, Dr. Ogundipi established a scholarship in 2001 in honor of his biology faculty mentor, UWSP Professor Emeritus, Dr. Joseph Harris. The scholarship recognizes a student with interest in health professions that has demonstrated academic achievement and involvement in research. Dr. Ogundipi says, my experience at UWSP is one that I call upon in my daily activities, both personal and professional. It was truly a time of preparation and solid foundation for a successful life and career. Without my experience at UWSP, I would not be in a position to extend a helping hand to others. Upon graduation, Sydney plans to attend medical school and ultimately work in either oncology or anesthesiology. Over the 2019 winter session, she participated in the UWSP Winter Preceptorship Program at the Aspirus Wassa Hospital, where she is also a volunteer and currently works as a CNA. She is a member of the UWSP Women's Swim Team, serving as captain this year. She is also a member of Gamma Phi Delta Sorority, the UWSP Pre-Medicine Club, in which she serves as Vice President, and is a member of Athletes in Action. Sydney is also very active in research and is working on an organic chemistry research project with Dr. McGarry on the formation and functionalization of heterocycles, which are key components of pharmaceuticals using a copper catalyst. The hope is that the mechanism of reaction can be better understood so that ultimately costs and negative environmental effects of pharmaceuticals can be lowered. Sydney is truly an outstanding student who will be an excellent medical student and ultimately doctor. Congratulations, Sydney. Greetings, family, students, and colleagues. This is Professor Bob Rosenfield, vertebrate ecologist here at UW Stevens Point, and I'm going to say a few words on behalf of uh, Emily Colson. Uh, Emily is a uh, one of those uh, students who uh, exhibits the trifecta of engagement. She is in the classroom, an excellent student, very studious, uh, circumspect about the things that she's trying to assimilate and then feed them back in a meaningful way when we uh, assess their scholarship performances. In the field, she's been involved with uh, canvas back ducks, and she has also been involved with uh, turtles. And in regard to campus activities, she's also a member of the Wildlife Society 
and she helps the CNR in their annual research symposium. Uh, she also has been working in my lab this uh, past academic year until COVID-19 came along, uh, putting together a, uh, an analysis of a 40-year data set on reproductive performance of Cooper's Ox. Given all of those facets, it's an easy choice to have uh, uh, nominated her for uh, this uh, Frank Haney Ornithology uh, Scholarship Award and my distinct privilege uh, to speak on behalf of her receipt of such. I wish her the very best. Apparently, she's going on for grad school in raptor ecology, and I suspect that she will more than exceed the standards at whatever campus she enters. Alora Schroeder, a senior biology major from Western Wisconsin, is this year's recipient of the Kathleen Haney Secondary Education Science Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. Frank and Kathleen Haney of Crandon, Wisconsin, both graduated from UWSP in 1970. They created this scholarship in honor of the outstanding education that they received from UWSP. They were grateful for the willingness of the faculty to help them succeed as students. They also valued the appreciation faculty showed for the natural environment. They are proud that the UWSP tradition of openness and passion to further the education of students remains today. Frank is a practicing naturalist and continues to follow this passion in all aspects of his life. Both Frank and Kathleen spent their careers as teachers, passing on knowledge to generations of students. They created several awards to give back to the UWSP students that followed in their footsteps. This scholarship honors Frank Haney's wife, Kathleen Haney, who taught earth and life science to grades seven through 12. This award goes to the, a student majoring in natural sciences with a biology background who is planning to teach secondary education. This year's winner is Alora Schroeder. Alora plans to pursue a career in middle school or high school education, teaching students in the life sciences. She has a longer range goal of attaining a master's degree in the biological sciences. She has conducted independent studies at the UWSP Museum of Natural History and in the Animal Parasitology Lab. At UWSP, she is an active member of Tri Beta Biological Honor Society and has volunteered as a chaperone for College Days for Kids. Congratulations, Alora. Hello, everyone. I'm Professor Diane Caparel, and it's my honor to announce that Lorenzo Smith, a senior biochemistry major, from Green Bay, Wisconsin, is this year's recipient of the Frank and Kathleen Haney Biology Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. Frank and Kathleen Haney, both educators and UWSP alumni from 1970, created the scholarship in honor of the outstanding education that they received at UWSP. Um, this fall, Lorenzo will be starting a bioscience PhD program at the University of Utah in molecular biology and biological chemistry, also known as biochemistry, to study the molecular underpinnings of neurological disorder and disease. His ultimate goal is to have a research career at a university or a hospital. He hopes that his science will translate into novel therapeutic targets to help patients suffering from neurological disorder. At UWSP, he's worked with me researching and effects of unique mutations on splicing patterns in patients with muscular dystrophy and propionic acidemia. He also participated in a National Science Foundation REU program at North Carolina State University, working with Dr. Patricia Est to study the relationship between neurological transcription factor SIM and the metabolic signaling hormone, UPD2, in Drosophila melanogaster. On campus, he worked as an um, academic tutor, a chemistry teaching assistant, and an organic chemistry research assistant. He was an active member of the chemistry club and biochemistry club, uh, the Tri Beta Biological Honor Society, the Phi Eta Sigma Honor Society, and also treasurer for the UWSP Curling Association. And I just want to say congratulations to you, Lorenzo Smith. We will all miss you at UWSP and uh, give you um, uh, the world as far as, um, um, well, this is hard for me because I'm, I'll be missing you, um, but we wish you much success in your um, future endeavors. Congratulations. Hayden Juno, a junior biology major from Western Wisconsin, is this year's recipient of the Frank and Kathleen 
Haney Biology Education Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. Frank and Kathleen Haney of Crandon, Wisconsin, both graduated from UWSP in 1970. They created this scholarship in honor of the outstanding education that they received from UWSP. They were grateful for the willingness of UWSP faculty to help them succeed as students. They also valued the appreciation faculty showed for the natural environment. They are proud that the tradition of openness and passion to further the education of students remains today. Frank is a practicing naturalist and continues to follow this passion in all aspects of his life. Both Frank and Kathy spent their careers as teachers, passing on knowledge to generations of students. They created several awards to give back to UWSP students that follow in their footsteps. This award goes to a UWSP student majoring in biology, simultaneously seeking an education certificate to teach biology. Upon graduation, Juno plans to teach biology, environmental science, or chemistry at the high school level. He has been an AmeriCorps service member in the Wausau area. At UWSP, he has been a writing tutor in the Tutoring Learning Center, an active member of Aspiring Educators, and has been a volunteer chaperone for the College Day for Kids program. Congratulations, Hayden. My name is Paul Whitaker, Professor of Biology on the Wausau campus of UW Stevens Point. On behalf of the Department of Biology, I'm really happy to be presenting this year's Dr. Melissa DeWitt Larson Memorial Scholarship. Dr. L DeWitt Larson graduated from UWSP in 1993 and earned her Doctorate of Veterinary Medicine at UW-Madison just five years later. After losing her to cancer at far too young an age, her family created this scholarship as a tribute to her love of both animals and UWSP. It's awarded each year to an upper level biology major interested in veterinary medicine. This year's recipient is Olivia Reske Kretzer. While at UWSP, Olivia has done research on endangered mussels with Professor Dan Graff and on reproductive success in zebra finches with Professor Sarah Jane Alger. She served as secretary of the Pre-Veterinary Medicine Society, was active in the Tri Beta Biological Honor Society and in the Animal Behavior Club. She hopes to attend veterinary school and eventually practice veterinary medicine here in Wisconsin. I met Olivia in fall 2017 when she took my introductory botany course on the Wassa campus. She excelled in that class and seemed to enjoy it. Major drawback of teaching on a branch campus is that we so often lose track of our students after they transfer elsewhere to finish up their degrees. Presenting this award has allowed me to see the real impact of my botany course in Olivia's educational and career plans, which, as you can see, have nothing to do with botany. Huh. Nevertheless, I couldn't be more pleased to see her receive the Dr. Melissa DeWitt Larson Memorial Scholarship. Congratulations, Olivia, and good luck as you pursue your dreams in veterinary medicine. It's my pleasure to introduce the Delta Dental University Scholarship Award winner, Connie Misfelt. Connie is a sophomore, is a biology major. She's from Superior, Wisconsin. The overall goal of the Delta Dental Scholarship is to provide scholarships to recruit and retrain highly qualified students in this region who are interested in dentistry. Connie plans to go into dentistry and so I look forward to seeing her in a number of my classes coming up and she's also a member of the lacrosse team. Caleb Tenhagen, a senior biology major from Sturdivant, Wisconsin, is one of this year's recipients of a Delta Dental University Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. The goal of the Delta Dental Scholars Program is to provide scholarships to recruit and retain highly qualified students from the region with an interest in pursuing careers in dentistry. This highly competitive award is given the first academic year and renewed for two more years if the student's grade point is maintained. Congratulations, Caleb. Levi Erdman, a sophomore biology major from Scandinavia, Wisconsin, is one of this year's recipients of an outstanding sophomore biology student award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. The UWSP Biology Department began to recognize outstanding sophomores with dinner and a certificate in 2001. This recognition encourages these students to continue to work hard on their academic careers. Outstanding sophomores must have 13 credits in biology and a GPA of 3.8 or above. Congratulations, Levi. It's an honor to present the Outstanding Sophomore Biology Student Award to Taylor Keel from Madison. Taylor is a double major in biology and wildlife. Our best students um, 
understand that to to be a well-rounded professional sometimes it's a good idea to mix a basic science with an applied science and this has not been an easy thing to do with the with the transition so it's absolutely refreshing to see uh, outstanding students like Taylor going for the double major in wildlife and biology. Congratulations, Taylor. Haley Morris, a sophomore biology major from Berryville, Wisconsin, is one of this year's recipients of an outstanding sophomore biology student award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. The UWSP Biology Department began to recognize outstanding sophomores with dinner and a certificate in 2001. This recognition encourages these students to continue to work hard on their academic careers. Outstanding sophomores must have 13 credits in biology and a GPA of 3.8 or above. Congratulations, Haley. Cal Lee Thao, a sophomore biology major from Wisconsin Rapids, Wisconsin, is this year's recipient of the Outstanding Sophomore Biology Student Award from the UWSP Biology Department. The UWSP Biology Department began to recognize outstanding sophomores with dinner and a certificate in 2001. This recognition encourages these students to continue to work hard on their academic careers. Outstanding sophomores must have 13 credits in biology and a GPA of 3.8 or above. Cal Lee is interested in a wide range of careers in biology, including becoming a professor. She is also very passionate about healthcare and currently works as a certified nursing assistant. She has volunteered to help with restoration work at Schmeekley Reserve and is an active member of the Hmong and Southeast Asian American Club, the Pre-Med and Pre-Physician Assistant Club, and the Archery Club. Congratulations. I would like to congratulate Ryan Wagner, a biochemistry major from Indianapolis, Indiana, who is this year's recipient of the Culver Rogers Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point. This award was created by the UWSP College of Letters and Science in memory of Gary Culver, the first chairman of the UWSP Chemistry Department, and Thomas Rogers, the second chairman of the Chemistry Department. The scholarship goes to a returning junior majoring in biology, chemistry, biochemistry, physics, or natural science. The student must exhibit an extraordinary level of both academic aptitude and professional development. It is no surprise that Ryan won this award as he is an outstanding student. In addition to his academic excellence, Ryan plays goalie for the UWSP men's hockey team. He is a member of the Athletic Advisory Committee and was just selected as treasurer of the Pre-Med Club. Ryan also volunteers in the emergency department at St. Michael's Hospital and for the Community Connections team at Marshfield Clinic. During the summer, he will be participating in a research project looking at cancer therapeutics at SR International. Upon graduation, Ryan plans to attend medical school. With Ryan's academic accomplishments and devotion to the service of others, he is sure to make an excellent medical student and eventually a wonderful doctor. Congratulations, Ryan, and good luck. Dr. Sarah Orlovsky is also this year's winner of the Excellence in Scholarship Award from the Department of Biology. This award is determined by a vote among biology faculty peers, and it recognizes a member of the department who has conducted an exemplary level of scholarship during the previous calendar year. Scholarship may include authorship of books, book chapters, journal articles, and agency reports, or activities on editorial boards of scholarly journals and presentations of research results at scientific conferences. Dr. Orlovsky has established herself as one of the leaders in scholarship in our department, and we expect her to maintain and continue that productivity because she's shown so much promise. Dr. Ashley Driver of Port Edwards, Wisconsin is this year's recipient of the Excellence in Teaching Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. This award is determined by a vote among the biology faculty and recognizes a member of our department with particularly strong teaching evaluations during the previous calendar year. We also consider the candidate's pedagogical professional development activities, including scholarship in journals and books devoted to biological or science education. Dr. Driver is originally from Beloit, Wisconsin. She received her bachelor's degree from the University of Wisconsin-Madison in animal science and natural science, and her PhD from UW-Madison in the Department of Dairy Science, where she used molecular genetic techniques to examine early embryonic development in mammals. 
She then completed a postdoctoral fellowship at Cincinnati Children's Hospital Medical Center in the Division of Human Genetics, where she worked to characterize novel mutations that alter early brain development in children. She joined our UWSP faculty in 2017 and currently teaches cell biology and developmental biology. Dr. Brian Berenger of Stevens Point, Wisconsin is this year's recipient of the Excellence in Service Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point Biology Department. This award is determined by a vote of the biology faculty and recognizes a member of our department who has gone above and beyond in service activities. This service includes service to the biology department, the university, and or the larger community. Dr. Berenger earned his bachelor's degree at the University of California, Davis, and his PhD at Cornell University. He began at UWSP in 2013, and he has taught numerous courses, including introductory botany, evolution, ecology, plant ecology, and he also conducts research on plant breeding systems, including undergraduates in those activities. Over the past year, on top of his regular teaching research and advising duties, he has served as the biology department admission and recruitment liaison, meeting with potential incoming students and arranging for current students to meet with recruits. He also does a lot of outreach and other activities. And he was recently elected biology department chair. Congratulations, Brian. Dr. Krista Slemons of Boulder Junction, Wisconsin, is one of this year's recipients of the University Scholar Award from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point. These awards are determined by committee and recognize peers who have conducted an exemplary level of scholarship during their time at UWSP. This scholarship may include authorship of books, book chapters, journal articles, or agency reports, or activities on editorial boards of scholarly journals, presentations of research results at scientific conferences, and the like. Dr. Summons was born in Germany, but spent most of her life growing up in a small town in northwestern Ohio. She has a bachelor's in biology from Denison University, a master's in education from Wright State University, a master's in conservation biology from Miami, Miami University in Oxford, Ohio, and a PhD in ecology from the University of Maine. She is a paleoecologist and limnologist, and she began her research career working on macroalgae in San Salvador, Bahamas. Since then, she has worked on alpine lakes in the Rocky Mountains and Arctic lakes in East Greenland, comparing lakes that are fed by glaciers to those that are fed by snowmelt. She currently examines the effects of climate and nutrients on lakes within the Great Lakes Basin. Dr. Slemons also does research in science teaching methods in secondary education and mentors secondary science education majors. Congratulations, Krista.